What is up guys, Adam here, and welcome back to the 25th episode of my AC Milan career mode. And this is a quarter of a hundred, <laughs> a quarter of a hundred episodes. You never know, I might be able to get to a hundred episodes in this Milan career. And today we're starting off with the first leg of the round of 16 of the Champions League trophy. We are taking on Zenit. We're going to take a look at the other seeds. It's Barca, Juve, Bayern, Saint-Etienne, Real Madrid, United. That is, These are some very good games on the left side. Olympiacos, Napoli, Valencia, Liverpool, uh, Manchester City, PSG, like in real life, and Atletico, Chelsea. So here's my starting 11. Donnarumma, Abate, Umtiti, Romagnoli, Gaia, Benassi, Basuer, Bonaventura, Verdi, Ibrahimovic, and Carlos Baca. Last time I said I was going to stay on world class, but I just brought it back to legendary. It was just really pissed off last episode. It doesn't take much for me to get pissed off in FIFA. And we're taking on Zenit, and they have a really small ground, which is really weird. Usually, I'd think they'd have a better ground than this. And round the 16, hopefully we can walk out of here with a victory and set us up in a good position for the next match at the San Siro. Benassi, and we're gonna, they're going to get a foul. <laughs> oh, that's a nice cross. Get there, the Shedley Bazuar. Beautifully done, but it falls to Ansaldi. Ansaldi being blocked by Abate, and he forces him out for yet another corner for Zenit. Ah, watch this corner, watch this corner, Donnarumma, come out and catch that, oh, the big body of Donnarumma, let's just hold this and try and see if we can seal out this first half, that's the end of the first half, nil nil, we should have scored, they should have scored, it should be at least 1-1. One, one. No, 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 Don no, no, come on, ah, oh, Donnarumma, what are you doing over there, catch that, don't let it go like that. We're down 1-0, it, it was, what was that, the cross into the middle, Donnarumma punched it away, it hit off Abate, and I think that's Shatov to put that one into the back of the net, yeah, so like Shatov, first goal, we're down 1-0, 54th minute, to Zlatan, get there Zlatan, come on Zlatan, please Zlatan, please Zlatan, don't call that a foul, Zlatan, cut. come on, come on, what is happening, we got a free kick, and not a free kick, we got a corner kick, None of my players are here, obviously, obviously, obviously. Okay, Verdi, let's go into the middle. Who's there? Benassi with the header! That's Umtiti! Yes, Samuel Umtiti with the headed goal in the 61st minute, and we've drawn level. Nice cross into the middle by Verdi, and it is 1-1 by Samuel Umtiti. Nice cross in by Simone Verdi. I don't know why he wasn't there from the beginning. Umtiti just got to that one, and that one's into the back of the net. For him, Titi's first goal in the Champions League this season. Watch the cross. That's a na. Oh, Donnarumma! Oh my goodness, what a save by Gianluigi Donnarumma, keeping the game level. That is incredible. Bazuera, let's send this up to Verdi. Okay, Verdi pushes forward off of Donnarumma's big save. And to Baca. Baca, can he get there? Baca on the ball. Oh my goodness, we cannot capitalize on that. That's the end of this match. A 1 1 draw. Bullshit goal by Zenit, but we worked hard. And came back and we walk out of here with a 1-1 draw going into the home leg of this Champions League round of 16. Look at that, Donnarumma, a 9.8 match rating. He made 11 saves in this match. Could have been 3 or 4-1 for Zenit if it wasn't for Donnarumma. Now after last episode's abysmal run of games, we're currently in 3rd place behind Juve with 54 and Lazio with 50 points and our next match is coming up against Juventus. So our lineup for this match is Donnarumma, Florenzi, Tonelli, Romagnoli, Gaia, Bazoer, Baselli, Gerhard, Saponara, Balotelli and Carlos Baca. Strength versus strength, 20 goals allowed best in Serie A and 48 goals scored for Juventus. That is absolutely crazy given the amount of games we played. So they're gonna look to put in a lot of goals this game and uh, hopefully, you know, we can take advantage of that and try and score a lot. I don't, I don't even know what I'm trying to say right now. And how in the world did we just get a foul? Okay, Bazoer to Gerhard, Gerhard, Baselli. Baselli once again to Mario Balotelli. Let's take this forward, Balotelli. Okay, Balotelli's gonna cut inside. Okay, Balotelli almost gets through. I tried to do a bit too much, but I had no angle to shoot. So I just tried to weave my way into the box. Watch Alaba on the wing, Romagnoli, God, oh, oh my god, Donnarumma, oh my goodness, Donnarumma, what kind of a save was that, he is on fire this episode, he's saving everything, Bazoer, 
please, Rishad Libazoari, you got to do better than that. Vaseli up to Florenzi. Uh, they're already freaking playing park the bus. Saponara, Saponara over the top. Oh, come on, man. Come on. Somebody, somebody get on the end of that. There's Baselli, but he cannot get there. That's the end of the first half. We've had the majority of the chances. Hopefully, we can put one in in the second half. So, I'm bringing on Simone Zaza to play against his former club for Baca because Baca hasn't been all that well in this first half. Baselli, Balotelli. Over the top to Ibra. And obviously, okay, Ibra. Yes, nicely done. Ibra into the middle. Zaza get there. Zaza against his former club. Zaza in the 90th minute against his former club. I don't care. He's celebrating. We're up 1-0 against Juve. We're up 1-0 against Juve in the 90th minute. Zlatan coming on and sending in the cross. That breaks through Zaza. And that one's into the back of the net. And I don't care if it's his former club. I don't care. That one is into the back of the net. And it looks like we're going to win against Juve. The initial ball, I think it was from Balotelli to Ibra. And Ibra out muscles Zuma. And Zaza is there to put that one into the back of the net. It was almost saved once again by Gianluigi Buffon. He's been saving everything this game. I don't know how many shots I've taken. First goal this season. First goal with Milan. And we're up in the 90th minute. And I'm going to park the bus because Juve has been playing fucking park the bus the whole match. And that's the end of this match. We pick up a victory against Juve. Oh, it feels really good. It feels really good to finally win again. I know it's 1-0 and the last time I won was like four or five games ago. Donnarumma made a few saves. Buffon saved their ass the whole game. And we walk out of here with very, with a very, very big three points. Five shots on target. They took three. And uh, once again, Donnarumma with four saves. And uh, we walk out of here with three points. So we do have this game against Fiorentina coming up. But we do have the semifinals of the Coppa Italia coming up in a few days. And it's an away match. And I am going to be simulating this match. Because I want to fit in three very crucial games in this episode. Our lineup is Sportiello, Calabria, Tonelli, Capuano, Acampora, Benassi, Gerhard, Suzo, Verdi, El Sharawi, and Zlatan Ibrahimovic in the 4-5-1 formation. I'm going to simulate all the way to the end of the match and we are going to pick up a 3-0 victory. One goal by Bonaventura, one goal by Ibrahimovic, and one goal by Simone Verdi. And we pick up another very big three points. Final game of this episode and it is the semi-finals in the Coppa Italia. And if I'm not mistaken, this actually has two legs. So this is the home leg and then we are going to be playing an away leg at uh, Mape Stadium against Sassuolo. So hopefully we can jump into this match and pick up a victory and Domenico Berardi doesn't score against us. Line up for this match, Donnarumma, Florentium, Titi, Romagnoli, Gaia, Baselli, Basuer, Bonaventura, Saponara, Balotelli, and Carlos Bacca. I don't really know where Sassuolo places in the table. I think they were in the relegation zone last time and they only have one real threat and that is um, Domenico Berardi, as I've said so many times. And I think we actually lost against them last time. So hopefully we don't lose against them this time. And we can walk out of here with a very big victory. And that was just a very big morale booster to win against Juve last time. Vaseli up to Bona. Bonaventura to Baca. Baca the ball roll. Nicely done, Baca. Baca, finesse shot. Carlos Baca, the save by Consi. Baca could still finish in the box. That was a very nice save by Conci to Baselli. Baselli into the middle. Miziroli. Bonaventura actually gonna take it. Let's send this into the middle. There's Balotelli. Balot oh, tries to go for the header. Baselli. Bazoer. Bazoer the shot. Richetli Bazoer. It's blocked. Nice. Kaya up to Baselli. Baselli to Jack Bonaventura. Bonaventura inside. Jack. Somebody help him to Saponara. Saponara! Nicely done, Ricardo Saponara. His first goal since coming back to AC Milan. What a strike from inside the box. The power behind that shot was absolutely incredible. Nice layoff by Bonaventura. And the left-footed shot into the back of the net. Ricardo Saponara scoring on his return to Milan. And we're up 1-0. To Bazoer. Bazoer to Baca. Baca. Balotelli. Balotelli. Back to Baca. Baca with the shot. What a save by Conci. I think that was actually blocked by Ariado. That's the end of the first half. And we're up 1-0. A goal by Ricardo Saponara. We need to put in another one just to be safe from Domenico Berardi. That one's in. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. 
dominating the whole game and then they come out of nowhere and score this one just how in the world did the ball find its way over there where was my defender on that one that one's into the back of the net nothing i could do about that because that's how this game works you dominate the whole game then they come out of nowhere and score a stupid goal like that that's the end of this match that is what happens we take so many shots concede he saves everything this is legendary for you this is why i hate playing on legendary because it's so bullshit. You dominate the whole game and you still walk out of here with a 1-1 draw to Sassuolo. Let's just go take a look at the stats. They had one shot on target, turned to one goal. I had 10 shots, four on target. Most of them were blocked. And we're going into the second leg of the semifinals in a 1-1 draw against Sassuolo. So that is the end of this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. We played some fairly decent games. Uh, we drew in the Champions League. We won against Juve, which was... Uh, it was very surprising then we won the simulated game against Fiorentina and then we drew against Sassuolo no losses in this episode thank you guys so much for watching this episode and I will see you next time do it do what just do it okay do what do it subscribe to our channel whoa calm down there Shia just do it! Also, follow us on Twitter at TheNobsYT. Just do it!